Hello everyone, I hope you hear me better now because I have a mic now. Um, I thought I'll get a mic to see if that works better. So we are talking about right riches again because there are so many questions. Questions about what is right riches and how come it's right and it's rich and what is the right way to be rich and what is the wrong way to be rich. Well, what is the right way to be rich there is no right way this is why it's called right riches for you um, and what it actually means is do what works for you what you learn in the right riches for your class is to remove the limitations that keep you from having your way this is where you're actually told what you are supposed to do and how you should be or what you should do in order to have money. Um, we grow up with so many points of views and limitations from our family, from our social background, from our friends, what we should be, what we can be, what we cannot be. You're just not born into this reality. Well, this is for the others. You're not one of those. Um, these are points of view. We grow up with those points of view. And when you then talk to your friends and family, that you dream about being rich and all that stuff, well, do they make you wrong or do they empower you? Well, most of the people make you wrong because being rich has so many judgments. I mean, the rich bitch. <clears throat> yes, I even use that term. <laughs> Hello, Laura. Hi, Chrissy. Everybody's watching. <clears throat> and I'm talking about rich and the judgments about rich again. So. There are so many judgments about being rich and so many rich people are mean. Yes, that's correct. But does that mean that you automatically become a mean person once you have money? Um, I guess it's a big no. Because people who are kind, people who desire to <clears throat> contribute to our planet, people who desire to create a different, different future for our planet, they are not mean. And you are mean and you are not mean. Money doesn't turn you into mean. It's the person who is mean. So it's not the money that actually changes your character and turns it into the black soul of so many rich people. <laughs> people have a black soul already. Um, with money, you just see it more because these people are more powerful and more present. Um, so back to the initial question, why right riches and what is the right way to be rich and what is the wrong way? There is no right or wrong, there is your way. And once you are over the point of view that you cannot be rich, that you shouldn't be rich or that being rich is nothing that you could choose because, well, not your world. Once you remove these limitations and these roadblocks, well, then we are talking about your way of being rich because it might look a little different than you now expect it. Um, and this is what this Right Riches View class is about. It's getting over these limitations and points of view, what you're supposed to be, who you are supposed to be, and how much money you're supposed to make. And so many people always tell you, well, can't you never get enough? And I always say, no, I want more. And can't you, will you ever be happy? And n nothing, I mean, how much more do you want? It's this being made wrong for demanding more. This is what we are told. No, leave it to the others. Once you have this amount of money, it's enough. <clears throat> um, I have a different point of view. And this is probably why I'm starting to facilitate these classes again. Because my point of view is whatever works for you, no, much, no, no matter how much you want, well, go for it. Go for it. <laughs> Demand it. And please enjoy it. And you don't have to justify why you want more. Well, it's just more fun to have more money. Why would it not be more fun? And do you need money to have fun? No, you don't. But with money, it might be more fun because things are easier with money. Um, so 
I hope your question is answered. What is right and what is wrong about being rich? Nothing. It's your choice. And right riches for you is what works for you. What actually works for you financially once the roadblocks, limitations and all the lies you bought about what you can have, what you can't have um, <clears throat> are finally removed. And then let's see what you can create and what you desire and what's fun for you. So many people don't even allow themselves to dream and to, to demand it because they think they can't have it. Yeah, talk about limitations and talk about money and talk about your financial situation. Um, well, it's normal. This is what we grew up with. This is what's normal for us. And you wouldn't be watching this life or considering coming to the class if you had a slightly different desire in your beautiful little universe. So please demand it, be more of it, and don't worry. You don't have to become a millionaire within a week. Right Riches for You is about removing those limitations and giving you a different point of view, an idea of how you could look at your money fat situation, how you could look at your own crea creations. And it's act it actually opens the door of, okay, so if money wasn't an issue, if limitations around money and wealth and richness wasn't an issue, what would you choose? So let's remove all these limitations and points of view that we all bought from family, friends and other lifetimes. And then let's see what you truly desire. It doesn't have to be money. It doesn't have to be the rich that we know from this reality. It can be something completely different. So let's explore it together <laughs> and let's see what shows up. I have a whole list of other questions, but we have how many days? Four or five days to go. So I will do more Facebook Lives now to answer more questions about what right riches for you is about, is not about, might be about, or is definitely not. Um, yeah, just stay tuned. I'm not sure if I'll make it at the same time every day because I'm really busy at the moment. Um, yeah, but you can rewatch it. <laughs> so don't worry, you won't miss anything. If you have questions um, or if you're curious what Right Riches for You is about, I'm doing an evening taster on Friday at 5 p.m. for an hour and a half where we will dive into some kind of ideas that you could get out of the class and some kind of common limitations a lot of people have. And then, well, you can always choose. You can jump on. There is no uh, time limit for registration. If you wake up Saturday morning at 9.45, you can still register and come to class. Um, the people working at my back end might hate me now because they <laughs> have to set you up and get, get to the logins. But they are amazing. They are brilliant. They are able to handle last minute signups. So yeah, just do what works for you. Um, come and join us for the evening taste. And then let's see if you are willing to find your way of being rich. And I'm curious to find out what different ways of being rich are out there. So if you want to share that, let's start that conversation. We start Friday, 5 p.m., Saturday, Sunday. Uh, we are on from 10 a.m. in the morning till 4 p.m. in the afternoon. <clears throat> hello, hello everyone. Now they are all coming on now. <laughs> when I want to finish, <laughs> everybody jumps on. Um, <clears throat> so let's continue tomorrow um, about some other questions I received about right riches for you because many people um, wonder how to get how to stop that roller coaster of having money and spending it and once they have it they spend it again um, I don't want to answer that question now but I can tell you one thing it's absolutely okay you're not wrong that you always spend more than you actually have and uh, there are ways to have ease with this roller coaster what I call your financial situation. Just make sure the roller coaster is high up there uh, and not always down there where um, there is so much more month left. Um, once the money is over, <laughs> we can 
flip that over so that at the end of the month enough money is left so you have some something left to start creation of wealth which is another question i received what's the difference between having money and creating wealth so we'll probably do that on wednesday um well that was it my friends uh, i hope you enjoyed it i hope you uh, had a very clear voice with my new microphone if not let me know and i'll get another one okay Thank you, everyone. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.